is an exhibition called 50 Years, 50 Knockout Works. Celebrating our 50th birthday really gave me an opportunity to reflect on many of those really important New Zealand artists that we've worked with over that 50 years. And I thought, what better way to showcase the work than pick 50 outstanding works from gallery artists, all paintings which have passed through the gallery over the years, and bring them together to mark that occasion. And in a lot of instances, the works were exhibited here and then sold to private clients in the 60s and the 70s, and they've never been seen. This exhibition really gave me an opportunity to bring together some really important works that perhaps have been hidden from public view that are really good examples of our artists' work. One of the works that I'd like to draw your attention to is this beautiful Michael Illingworth painting. It was painted in the 1980s and is a portrait of Dad, simply titled The Dealer. On the left hand side you can see he's painted a typical Illingworth painting and on the right hand side a Milan Merkezic work. I just think it's incredibly sweet and a delicate work. It was purchased by a private client in the 1980s and has never really been exhibited before. It's just been in the client's home. But I just think it's a, a lovely, very sweet work. Work is titled, Boy, I was scarred, now I am stoned. And the work is very much a comment on the status of Māori. Peter is a Māori artist from Naitahu and he's very much poking fun or poking and investigating what it is to occupy that cultural position. It's interesting that 20 years on, the work is still as relevant and contemporary as ever. And in fact, so many young people, particularly that have been through the gallery, have been so engaged with the work and some of the ideas that Peter's interested in. As part of the exhibition with our existing gallery artists, I suggested, why don't you pick a work that you think is the most iconic Example, when people think of Yvonne Todd, what do they think of? So Yvonne selected this work for me, which was made in 2009, and is simply titled Frenzy. A woman sits in a basement, or possibly a construction site, dressed in an oversized prairie dress, false teeth, the wig, all those hallmark Yvonne Todd traits that people know and love. A piece of string hangs from the timber. Who has put her there? The narrative is suggested, but nothing is given away. Very, very interesting work, and actually one of my favourites in the exhibition. When I came to run the gallery in 2010, I was incredibly lucky to have the opportunity to be mentored by my father. So a lot of the way that I run the gallery today are still uh, defined by some of his principles on how to treat people, how to run a business, and the kind of atmosphere that we want to create here and the kinds of shows we want to put on. So I think one of those values which I really try and focus on today is that galleries are a place for all people, that everybody when they come into the space should be made to feel welcome, we should roll out the red carpet, and every person, no matter who you are, can find something that touches them and connects them with the work, the exhibition.